What's up, gamers? The time has finally come. We are loading up now, small lands. I started this recording as soon as I clicked on the game. So you guys can see each and every inch of what we got going on here. I'm pretty excited about this, man. I've been looking, I've been looking forward to this for a long time. Uh, is this your first time playing this? If so, click here to create an account. Okay, sure. That was it? All right. Let's uh, let's click the play button. Character name, see through, obviously. All right, we got a little customization going on here. We're gonna go male, male gentle, male strong. Okay, this is changing our facial structure. What kind of ears do we got here? Wow, we got some super funky ears. Okay. Is there just a randomized bro? I'm honestly, oh, okay, okay. I changed my mind. What kind of beards we got, dude? All right, we gotta go with the fully. The fully. Uh, brown, yeah. I'm actually kind of digging these uh, these ones here. There we go. Nice little antenna situation. Color. We gotta go with the orange. You already know it. We're on fire, bro. Um, do we have a bald? Yes, we are bald. <laughs> yeah hair color doesn't matter uh double pupil i feel like maybe you know it's not oh okay snake eyes we're like reptilian there we go nut yeah we like nut we like nut warm oh wow dude we could be like all right we're going warm Oh, we got face markings too? Okay. Sure, let's do that. Sounds good to me. Uh, your game will be available for other players to join. Um, creatures will not attack you, but will fight back if attacked. All right, let's just make a password. Wait, why does it, hold on. I don't want you guys to see my password, bro. That's crazy. Um, st start. World name, see through. Oh, I'm just gonna call it Mega Builds. All right. There we go, dude. We're loading in. Ha <laughs> I'm so excited. Small lands. Um, so I'm going to be making daily uploads of this game, uh, daily let's plays, mega builds, let's plays. We're going to test the mega build potential of this game. And, uh, yeah, intrepid vanguard, your queen is ill, gravely ill. This is why as your king, I am asking for your help. Venture into the overland and seek out a cure, whatever the cost. Be bold, be brave and remain vigilant. Ha! From the King Valdemar's speech to the Vanguard Corps. Oh my god, here we are. We're in the game. Wow, would you look at that? Would you look at that? He kind of runs like a little derpy derp derp. Derp 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 derp. <laughs> Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. Yeah. Sentinel Virgil. F to talk? That's weird. Oh, God, words. I don't like words. What did he say? I've been tasked with meeting all vanguards before they leave the burrow, as I have crucial information. Keep a keen eye trained for the owl effigies. They are scattered throughout the area and provide useful hints and tips to help survive. Outside, you'll find Captain Hearn. He will help you in your first days outside in the burrows. Owl effigy. Overland is rich with natural resources and food. Some can only be harvested with the correct tool. You can craft different tools and harvest natural resources. Some resources can only be harvested with specific types of tools. So be sure to learn the best tool for the job. Press V to engage antenna mode in order to help you spot harvestable resources much easier. Antenna mode. All right, why is E not the pickup button? 
All right, how did I do this? Okay, V is antenna mode. All right, give me more. Antenna mode activate. Is there more resin? Fire arrows. That's cool. Dude, we can mantle? Did I just mantle? Oh my god, we can mantle, dude. That's crazy. Okay, what does E do that is not... Okay, hold on. Settings. Input. Block? What about right click? Block? E? No, we're gonna have to find something else for different for that. Um, interact needs to be E, please. Yes. Yeah, much better. Much better. All right, builder's hammer, wooden hatchet, wooden club unlocked. Let's go, tab to opens inventory. Um, all right, so we can craft from our inventory, it looks here. Um, let's see here. Requires fiber and wood, wood, fiber and wood, fiber, wood and resin, firefly juice. Okay. All right. Oh, another owl effigy. Uh, press tab to open inventory and select a codex to help keep track of all the workstations and items you can craft. Uh, you can also check on which armor sets can be crafted by which small folk once you seek them out. Roger that. Okay, cool. I'm loving, I'm digging my fire antennas right now, dude. Fire antennas okay the movement is kind of cool really uh antenna mode all right so the sprouts drop the fiber on the ground the burrow is an extensive network of underground tunnels and caverns that is home to the small folk the tunnels are incredibly intricate with multiple levels branching paths that stress for hundreds of yards in all directions they are lit by growing crystal lamps and makeshift torches, creating a warm, inviting atmosphere. Stop calling me Cox Communication. I don't want anything to do with you. I disconnected my Cox internet the other day, and they're not happy with it. They are not happy. All right, let's go. All right, what do we got here? Sentinels. My wife can make a mean pixie omelet. Food at the root barracks has become pretty stale lately. Luckily, my sister brought me some fresh insect eggs this morning. Ew. Luckily, I just yoinked them. What do you got to say? All you need for speedy repairs is a good builder's hammer. Mold, mold everywhere. <laughs> he is not happy about the mold. Make sure to search out the LFGs for useful information. Yes. Look at this place. This place is so colorful, man. So colorful. Good luck in the Overland Vanguard. Keep your wits about you and stay frosty. May the sacred owl be with you, Vanguard. Dude, look at the water. The water looks cool. Oh, wow. The sounds, too. Okay. All right. Looks like we have a fatigue bar at the bottom of the screen uh, for running stamina, I guess. Sentinel Arthur, I wish I wasn't on night watch duty. The Overland is a dangerous enough place during the day. Captain Hearn is stationed downhill from here. You can go t and introduce yourself to him. Okay. Oh, look, another owl effigy. And some more sticks. Hello. You can lose health due to a variety of factors, being attacked by hostile creatures, extreme temperatures, or falling from a great height. Or being malnourished. On the bright side, you can recover health by using healing items, keeping yourself well nourished or sleeping. Gimme, gimme, gimme. All right. Sprinting, sliding, dodging, jumping, attacking, and blocking are consumed stamina. All consumed stamina. Pay attention when it becomes low and manage it carefully and do not leave yourself vulnerable. Roger that. Roger that. Um, let's see here. Anything else I can collect? in this little part of the piece of the place right here. Doesn't look like it. Um, so do we have enough stuff? To, we have enough stuff to craft a wooden hatchet, a wooden club, a builder's hammer. Okay, how do I attach them to a hot bar of some sort here? So we've got a wooden club, we've got a hatchet. Uh, where is the hot bar? 
Um, use and equipped. Oh, it's on it's on the top. I see it now. I see it now. Okay, we put that there, we put that there, we put that there. Okay, so now we have access to our different stuff. Okay, right click for structures. Okay. Alright, alright, easy enough. Easy enough. I'm I'm tracking right now, I'm tracking. That's one hell of a hammer, dude. Jesus. More stuff. All right, so we're picking up and blocking with the same button. Let's go. I can work with that, I guess. I can work with that. Uh, armor provides protection against different types of damages and can also keep you warm in the cold weather. Some settlers in the Elder Land have the experience or expertise to make new sets of armor for you, provide you give them the required materials. Hearn. Uh, greetings, Vanguard. Welcome to the Overland. I am Captain Hernest Manikabi. But most small folk simply call me Hearn. What can I do for you? Can I ask you some questions? Yes, sure. Which questions? Uh, how do I build myself a shelter? Where do I find food? Thank you, Captain. I'm ready to go. Okay. Um, let's see here. I'm trying to figure out the little eye. Could you craft me some armor, Captain? Uh, let's see here. What do you need? Fiber. 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 Fiber, 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 fiber. Okay, so in order to craft your armor, I need fiber. Roger. Oops, what did I click on? It didn't load fast enough. I was told to report to you for my assignment. Uh, yes, I have been expecting you. The Elder Ludwig has requested your presence. Go see him at once. He is staying in the cave just down the hill. Thank you, Captain. I am ready to go. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, Antenna view, activate. Oh. Give me the stuff. Give me the stuff. Okay, some more of this, some more of that. Uh-huh. All right, I'm definitely going to have to find a different button for blocking. Um, I wonder how much it really messes with it if I make right-click blocking, dude. Like, why would right-click not be blocking? Uh, block. Let's go right-click. Apparently, that's going to aim as well. I don't know if that's going to mess with anything. Okay, there we go. Now we can block with right. I wonder. Uh, I wonder if there's like perfect parrying, perfect blocking type of thing. If that's a, if that's a thing or not. But you know as well as I do that we are going to loot every freaking thing we can find because that is very important. Look at all, especially all this fiber, especially since that's going to be helping us craft our first set of armor at least, from what I could tell. Uh, we got another effigy here. <coughs> Temperature will generally drop at night and raise in the afternoon. Also, some creatures of the overland are nocturnal and will only come out at night. Watch out as night creatures are usually more dangerous than their daytime counterparts. Build a bed to set a new spawn point and have a place to sleep. You can only sleep at night and for all for you to fall asleep, you must be sheltered and there must be no hostile creatures around. Okay. So a little little arc situation going on there maybe. I get it, I get it, I get it. How many uh, fibers do I have now? What does fibers look like? Uh, fiber says I have three. Excuse me? Is it wood I'm picking up here? I thought it was all fiber. Okay, fiber, fiber. Five. What happened to all the fiber I just picked up? There's two, four, six, okay. Unless I have two stacks. Do I have two stacks? Oh, I, got, I do got two stacks. Okay, that makes sense. I was like, wait, what the? All right, resin as well. Lots of that. I'm assuming we, uh, we learn things by picking up things. Oh yeah, dude. We're gonna be doing some serious hoarding in this game. I'm excited. Uh, so excited. Okay, let's uh, let's continue forward a little bit here. I would like to talk to him to craft some armor, but I don't believe I have just enough quite yet. I do have like 40 something. Uh, let's see here, I can't chop any of this, right? Yeah, can't chop any of that, that's fine. Uh, what the heck was just popping up with a health bar? I'm assuming it was the butterfly, maybe? Oh, Lord have mercy. 
Okay, let's go back this way. All right, let's try a dot, a roll. Okay, control is roll. That's really weird to press there. Does C do anything? C crouches. Um, I think I would rather control crouch and C roll, honestly. We're kind of messing with the controls here a little bit, guys. Uh, let's go for roll. Okay, crouch will do... Oh, hold the slide. Yeah, okay. And then roll will do C. Yeah, right? Yeah, that sounds good. Okay. Yeah, we can do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah, that works. That's that feels a lot better. All right, let's see if you can craft some stuff for me. Oh, I missed an owl. Make sure to eat and drink regularly. Uh, being well nourished makes will make you more resilient and energetic as well as stronger in combat. You can find delicious berries in the forest, hunt creatures on the overland for food, or even cook your own meals. You can eat food raw or prepare it and other consumables uh, using different types of cooking stations for a wide range of benefits. Keep an eye out for tasty recipes. Okie dokie. Let's see here. Can you now sell me armor, please, sir? Uh, let's just start from the top and go down. Okay, I had enough to make three pieces. Uh, bracers, breachers, and wrap. Okay, assuming that... Uh... Can I only wear three pieces of thing? Padded, padded, padded. Wait, was all that like the same or something? Hold on. Uh, no, not the assignment. I want the crafting, please. Bracers, breachers, wrap, gauntlets, leggings, singlet. Okay. So we get movement speed, protection, and durability, cold protection. Okay, so I pretty much crafted the cold protection gear, I guess. Um, let's see here. So what are these stats in the bottom left here? Nourishment. Um, let's see, can I, okay, right click on it to eat it. That fills our nourishment up a little bit. That's the berries that we gathered. Oh, we got sprouts. Am I chopping the sprouts? Or are they just like regrowing into new, into new things? Uh, edible mushrooms, okay. Edible mushrooms. Let's go ahead and grab all this stuff. I don't know if there's like a weight limit. I don't recall there being a weight limit. Okay. Let's uh, see what this edible mushroom. Harvest. Here we go. I have a hole in my lip. Here we go, dude. The first half hour of small lands. Let's freaking go, dude. This is exciting. So far, first impression, the game feels really good, really smooth, really cooperative. We're running 100 FPS right now with no issues. Um, seems to be that there is a mushroom stuck in the floor there. I just got an autosave queue. So that's pretty good. Let's see your owl effigy. Uh, perception, such as rain and snow, or participation, such as rain and snow. Uh, can damage structures, so make sure your constructions are properly roofed to protect them from the elements. Uh, rain also makes plants and mushrooms grow back faster after you harvest them. Furthermore, weather affects temperature, so be sure to always wear the appropriate clothes. Sounds good. Sounds good. So I'm assuming I just keep heading, following this kind of trail situation here. Uh, while obviously harvesting absolutely everything that I can. Yes, yes, yes. Absolutely everything. This butterfly looks cool. Wonder what happens if I try to wax them. All right, let's see here. Let's see here. Oh, we got a ladybug. Don't tempt me, bro. I need that gold card, you know what I'm saying? Don't tempt me. More edible mushrooms. Multitasking. Whoa! You want the smoke? You want the smoke? Come here! Come here! No! Come here! Give me that gold card. Oh, you're stuck now, aren't you? No, 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 no. No, you started this crap. You came up on me. You pulled up on me. Come here. Come here. You seem so much more helpless in this game. Brother. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, you bring a little black ant friend in? What's up? 
Oh god, there's a few of them. Oh, it's getting lit, bro. Okay, we're chopping. We're chopping. Okay, we're chopping. We're chopping. We're rolling. We, we loot. We got bugs limps. Okay, we're rolling back. We're at half health. That's fine, though. We're good. Okay, we're fine. All right, we're good. Carpenter ants. Come on. Come on, let's go. Yeah, that's what I thought, brother. Get out of here. I'm just better. All right, so rule number one, let's not chase everything we see. Uh, here comes some bad weather, and now I ended up somewhere where I don't even know where I'm at anymore. So that's fun. Um, yeah, one thing's for sure. I need to eat some of these mushrooms. Yes. Bro, chill with the calling me. Okay, that's giving us a whopping like six nourishment, but that's fine. I wonder if our health just comes back over time or if we have some sort of uh, craftable situation here. I don't really know. All right, there is a great giant owl effigy on the hill there. I'm gonna try and see if I can make it over to that thing. Hoping that's where I have to go. I'm assuming we just heal back over time, maybe. Uh, probably potential to make some sort of healing salve or something. All right, let's get all that. I literally want it all. All right, so you cannot loot while you're jumping. I've noticed that, which is kind of interesting. Mm, okay, I think we found our way back to wherever the heck it was that we were. Go ahead and grab all of the resin. Literally all of it. Oh, we got another. We got another sp spider. Oh my god, dude, there's so many. Ah! Huzzah! I feel like I need to be able to cast a magic here. Okay. All right, how does the blocking work? Okay, the blocking is not instant. It takes a little second to block. I think I think I think dodging is our better is our better course of action here. Okay. They attack. It's a little hard to attack. Okay, nice roll. Oh god, the lunge. All right, we're go we're golden. We're golden. Can I can I are you going to drop anything for me, my dude? Okay. All right, we're gonna assume that I'm just supposed to go this way. Look, another owl effigy here. Is that another scary bug? The music, bro. Use bows and arrows to hit creatures from afar. This can be particularly effective against flying creatures. To use a bow, you must have both the bow and the arrows equipped. Draw your bow holding left click and release it by shooting the arrow. Uh, what? And release it to shoot the arrow. Different bows have different characteristics. Some are more accurate and powerful than others for maximum strength and accuracy. Be sure to fully draw the bow back when <gasps> before releasing. Okay. Very well. Are these harvestable? Doesn't look like it. More resin, dude. There's resin everywhere. How much resin have I collected here? 30? 30, 30? So that's 60, 79 resin. Okay. Well, we're doing good. There's more wood as well. I like collecting things, man. This is my jam. Okay. We got glowing mushrooms down there. Uh, can't exactly. Okay, we got that. Yep, cool. All right, we are, and we can mantle. Don't forget, we can mantle up. I, I didn't think I was gonna make that jump, and then I forgot that we can that we can mantle up, which is pretty pretty super awesome, really. All right, here we go. We're we're going up, dude. There's a bunch of what looks like moths up here. All right, we're just gonna get hooked up with some food, courtesy of the owl. Uh, small folk believe owls possess magical powers and worship them as some kind of a divinity. Uh, idol statues and decorations are crafted in their honor. Roger that. That is one big owl. All right. Well, if anything, he hooked me up with some berries. So thank you for that, Mr. Owl Man. Bro, I need to like, I need to like turn my freaking turn off my phone. Oh my god phone is going nutty right now all right here we go here's our torch um obviously at some point here i got turned around and or lost and this is not the way down 
Uh, we do not want to die to fall damage. Over. I repeat. No fall damage, please. So let's just take this, uh, take the safe way down. And let's follow these. Ow, okay, that hurts a little bit. Noted. It does not take much to fall to damage. Got it. All right, let's go ahead and grab some of this. What do we have here on the shoreline? What is this? Do it, can I harvest needs a mandibular axe? A mandibular axe or better. Codex. Come on, I click codex. Please don't tell me you just crashed, bro. Okay, I was about to say. Um, okay, so we got workbench, uh, crude hatchet, wood sword, mandibular pickaxe. I need a bull ant mandible. Do not obtain, have one of those just yet. Uh, we can make a simple bow. And wood arrows seem like something very easily to make. So that's good. Um, let's go ahead and get some more fiber here. All the fiber that I can possibly find and or see. Gimme, 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 gimme. Because I can use those to make arrows. Um, we do need to make some sort of structure probably for sleeping. What do we have here? What did I just pick up? A screw? Okay. Kind of hanging out on the beach right now. Waiting to get, uh, you know, hang it, like run into something dangerous. Um, let's see here. So, okay. I can pull out my hammer. Let's see if we can just lay down a basic little house uh, so I can throw a bed down so we can sleep here real quick. Um, so let's just do just a singular. No, we'll make it a we'll make it a little four by four. Okay, and then let's put up a let's put up a root a wall. Okay, all right. This is very very good. Uh, this is working out really really well. I'm actually very satisfied with the. But the way we can build here. Um, dismantle is C. I placed that in the wrong spot. Okay, that works out great. Uh, let's just throw up a simple roof, I guess. Just to give us somewhere to sleep for the moment. Okay. All right. I'm assuming we had enough material to do all this because um, I'm not seeing like where the cost of the material is or anything like that. But um, seems like it's working out for us. All right, let's go. Can I can I please place the last piece right there, just like that? All right, let's give us a door, little doorway situation. Okay, little double door. Uh, let's see here. Is this a door here? Twigs and leaf wall. Uh, door. Aha. Okay, so we now have a door. Insufficient materials. What am I missing? What am I missing here? So let's go ahead and dismantle this and see if I could just build a regular wall there. Wait, when I just, okay, I was about to say, when I dismantled that, did I have a, did it drop a thing? All right, let's just put a regular wall. Okay, let's open the door. All right, we are now inside the house. Now, what does it take for me to make a bed? Simple bed, check. Uh, campfire, check. Assuming it won't burn down this place, I guess. I guess we'll find that out. Uh, use the campfire. I can make ant skewers and mushroom steaks. Does it automatically craft it into mushroom steaks? Wow, I don't have to wait for it to cook? Oh, that's crazy. Okay. Uh, sleep. We're sleeping. We're sleeping, baby. Alright, so far the game is very easy to learn. That's good. Uh, we just reached our half hour mark on this video though, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, Chill out there for a second. I might shoot another video or I might just go live stream So make sure if you guys want to catch the in-between episodes of this mega build series from start to finish Join us live on twitch because I will be streaming this on twitch uh, Link is be in the description Make sure you like this video to help me out and if you made it this far into the video comment down below with the word Small people no, that's stupid. Let's just use the word leaf. So if you watch this video up to this point, use the word leaf in the comments and hide it. Don't just put leaf, but hide it. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.